As the state eligibility for COVID vaccines increases, more people are scheduling appointments. However, some are scheduling multiple appointments at different locations to secure their spot and then forgetting to cancel the duplicate. One uh, after uh, once they get that, uh, Gina Cadigan has more on uh, how WVU Medicine is dealing with these no-show appointments. We're seeing only about 35% of West Virginia citizens have received that first dose of vaccine. So we still know there's a, a large majority of folks that are out there that we would like to get vaccinated. As vaccines become more available, healthcare workers are preparing to vaccinate more people. West Virginians have several options as to where to get their vaccine, like WVU Medicine's location in the Morgantown Mall. But some are signing up for multiple spots at different locations and then forgetting to cancel their extra appointments once they get it. You know, originally we would only see about a half of a percent of no-show rates, which is very, very low. Um, this week we've seen up to a 10% no-show rate. Since more people haven't been showing up, the clinic has adapted a way to not waste their extra doses. If at the end of the day we do have some extra doses left over, we have a waiting list that we have established um, that we will then call people and ask them to come within the next 30 minutes to get a vaccine. WVU Medicine wants people to make sure they cancel their extra appointments so that others get the opportunity to sign up. It, and it is our hope that we start seeing more and more people, you know, wanting to get the vaccine and kind of changing their mind now. Uh, when they may, they may have not have wanted the vaccine originally. WVU Medicine has started offering later hours and Saturday appointments to try and encourage more people to get vaccinated. In Morgantown, Gina Cadigan, 12 News.